Hi everybody, so I'm back with Project Life Week 4 and well, let's get started. Um, I have pulled some stuff that I thought I was going to use and this is... I bought it with uh, a pack of insert pages um, but I really like that it has a vertical and horizontal 4 by 6 so this week I actually had my first uh, showing my paintings and it, it was really really amazing <laughs> so yeah so mostly of the photos are from that uh, from that day and I also have a photo of my room well actually of my desk and this photo I'm working on right now it's the photo of uh, I got a tree from my aunt and it's apparently it's a bonsai tree uh, the little Japanese tree and I have no idea how to keep it alive I am not good with plants so that will be very interesting here is a little uh, display photo and my room and that other photo says Julia K it's uh, a presentation one of the artists wrote about me so I thought it was really fun to have that too and then I wanted to make a title on the um, um, that uh, one of four by sixes and I want to write uh, form which is the name of the gallery and I had seen some of that light pink flowers uh, in the uh, flower pack in the open book collection and I really wanted to have the same shade uh, for the letters and those letters are from Tired Angel. Uh, it comes with the frames, the inside of the frame and then the letters so one shape is actually three shapes. So anyway I'm going to do that and I think it was just luck honestly okay maybe I thought about it so I go with a pink gelato and these I have these four gelatos and they are from the Tropic uh, set and then I'm just going to uh, smudge it around a bit and then I'm going to take and spray it with a third angel uh, mist and that is from a mini set so just a tiny bottle and it is mm, sand I think it's called if I can find it there it is <laughs> so I'm just going to take and spray it and then dry it I don't know what's going on with the footage okay so so I'm just going to take and dry it a bit yeah uh, by the way these tired angel mistable things they dry super quickly so yeah so I'm just going to spell uh, form right there and then I'm going to take um, a wood paper to write on because uh, I do want to have some journaling and I didn't just want it to be flat so um, yeah and my cutting machine does not cut straight so <laughs> uh, I wished for a cutting machine now in my birthday and my dad came home with a huge one it was like one of those with a guillotine um, the blade is on like an arm and I was like of all of the cutting machines that is the least one I want I'm so afraid of them <laughs> so he was going to try to find uh, someone that I will not cut my fingers off so yeah <laughs> so here I'm just going to put the letters down um, now the thing about this I have found is you really need to use glue to glue them down I didn't do this because I know they're going to be in a pocket but if you're going to have it on the layout then you should definitely glue it down um, yeah so I have the flowers and uh, now I'm just going to take and journal and that is taking time uh, I use my white white uh, is that it's jelly roll and it's medium and it's from um, Saka Sakura uh, Japan uh, I have had this for many many years and it's by far the best white pen I have it writes pretty much on, on top of everything you have to be patient with it because sometimes it doesn't really want to perform so you have to be easy with it um, and it has to be 
absolutely dry, um, which is sort of testing my patience a bit, but otherwise it is perfect. So, so here you can see, uh, I'm just going to switch that around so you can read it. <laughs> yeah, those pockets are really good, but it, um, yeah, I feel pretty stupid when you actually work on it. So, anyway, uh, the title page I'm going to take on one of those uh, four by three cards, and I'm just going to write week four with the tiny labels. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to find out what's the name. There are Tim Holtz tiny labels, and I have no A's left and nor uh, any N's, so that bothers me, but I think I have ordered, so I'm coming up with like three packs of them. <laughs> I love these letters. Perfect. I'm sorry, I'm playing with my pen, it has to be disturbing. So, uh, this Thursday, I turned 21, so I thought I was going to like make a little 21 card. Uh, in Sweden, that is not a big deal. I know that in like um, US, it's a big deal. You can start drinking and all that. But for us in Sweden, um, we start earlier. <laughs> it's not awful. Uh, but no, we actually start a lot earlier. So 21 is absolutely no big deal. So yeah. Anyway. <laughs> So uh, I'm just going to write down turn 21 and that I hope it will be uh, a great year. So yeah. And the flower pack from the Mega Homes I pretty much, pretty much used up so I definitely need to get a new one. But the store that I order stuff from, they don't have it. Nope. <laughs> and I'm so upset every time I go in there. Uh, I'm like, oh, there it is. It's out of stock. So. Here are just I write down things that I've enjoyed the past week, the book I write, the TV shows I watch, uh, music I listen to, uh, yeah, events that happened. Uh, you who follow me on Instagram know that I was with my aunt and her horse and been painting and all of that. So yeah, uh, I really like this uh, this layout and this pocket page style uh, that you get the 4x6 horizontal and vertical. Now this pe uh, pocket I have, it's a 6x8 pocket page projector from uh, Simple Stories and I have found it so much easier that uh, if I have a lot of um, memorabilia from a special ones I 